you could probably climb out the door, walk down the running board, and actually shut it while we're driving. Ben bought a fire truck. Check it out. Now we got some fun. Well, I'll get these plants watered, we'll be fine. The grass is coming in nice. Want to know the funniest thing about this pump? Tell me the funniest thing. If you're a fireman and you're running your engine and you're running your pump water, but you need to keep your nicotine habit up. There's a cigarette lighter, so you can light your cigarette while you're pumping your fire out. They thought of everything back in the day. And it's been used. Like, it's legit been used. Come on. Really? Hey, it's a hard day out on the fire line. Sometimes you need a little pick-me-up. What the heck were they thinking? This is fancy. It's not bad for 50 years old. Four-door, four-wheel drive. With a PTO winch on the front. What's what's this winch rated to? 18,000. 18,000 pound winch on the front. And it has been used a lot, you can tell. What year is this? 1975 International Lodestar, and it's called a uh, it's called a travel crew because you can travel with the whole crew. How do you always find the ones that are like just perfect? perfect no this is perfect it has its flaws Dude, it's got a desk light that works that you can move wherever here's your here's your winch control look at this monstrosity there it is there, there we go. go i mean it's mostly works well you don't want it to be blinding right this is your winch direction in cab winch control right and then here's your pto for your winch then here's your four wheel drive in and out and then your high and low and then you can run all your water stuff from here. This is your water pressure for that rear engine. And then you can yell at the kids when you're driving down the road. Casey, stop filming. Casey, stop filming. Never. See, that's funny for parades. And then you got the, the switches for all the lights. And then when people won't get out of your way, you turn on the siren. And you tell them, get out of the way now if you do that. Yeah, and they get out of the way. And you know how I know they get out of the way? Because I've tried it. <laughs> 10,524.7 on a 46-year-old truck. <laughs> What's that having out to like three miles a year? <laughs> Something, yeah. <laughs> Not many. Yeah, the worst part is I'm going to get so corrected on that math. Right? But look, it has GPS too. Oh, old school GPS. Yeah, that's, that's pre-Garmin. And for when you're done with your cigarette outside. Yeah, after you're done smoking out by the by the pump house in the back, you can come in and put your cigarette out. So that you don't start any fires. And then, then you can light another one right here. <laughs> Lucy, are you going to be the fire dog? Oh, yeah. Fire dog. Fire dog. So, there's actually multiple cool things about this. Well, the hood. Show me so, the hood cool so thing. You got your little handles you can step up right here. A workbench to stand on? Yeah, I mean, this is, you know... If that guy like me, it'll support us. But these open up to let the heat out. So when you're stationary and you're running the engine and you're running the PTO winch, when you get this behemoth of a 20,000 pound truck stuck, this lets the heat out while the engine's revving up higher. Close that. Then, what's cool is, this is the last year they did the butterfly. So both the hoods open like that. What size engine is this? So this is the 392 gas V8, which it's not huge. It's four wheel carburetor. I bet it makes 200 horsepower probably. <laughs> it's not fast. And you drove it 100 miles home? 130 miles over two mountain passes and it did not go fast because it has an Allison automatic, which has overdrive. So you, I mean, you got the one, the two, the three, and then click into the, the OD for, you know, whatever that does for you. But 
she you know on the flat ground she's she's a cruiser she'll go 52 55 57 and then when we got to the hills she's was right about 17 miles an hour on the hill and that was with no water in it this is all your fire hydrant adapters so all pumps everything completely functional yeah no every that that was one of the scenes water canteens it's missing a couple of the chemical fire extinguishers that's the four cylinder industrial ford motor that's a v4 yeah it's industrial nice it's like meant for a uh, stationary equipment like a pump or a generator or something like that that's you know the best part huh. is they put a mini dual exhaust on i it know for the v4 it pump has, and it only has one exhaust and, for the main, <laughs> and one exhaust for the big old v8 up now what's really funny is, is that's the same as the diesel exhaust i wish it had a diesel motor it doesn't but that's the same as a diesel exhaust more hose yeah. Like all, all the doors work just fine, nice and smooth. Everything. It's crazy. It's it actually was uh, cer uh, certified and used by the city of Corvallis up until 2016. So this truck was how old and still in use? Math people. Um, well, 22 how minus old? 16 is 6, and it is 46 years old. So it was in service for 40 years of its life. Is he right? 41. 41. 75 to Correct 16, us. 41. Then they also gave me the original fire truck manuals, which is the company that built the firebox, gave them the manuals on how everything works. I have the original line set ticket, which is from International, on how the truck was built. And then I have the original dealer paperwork and all of the upfitter paperwork to show all the costs and everything on, out here, which I can say on video, or we can have people comment down below how much they think this cost when it was brand new in 1975. Okay, time out. Comment right now how much you think it costs. We need to go drive a fire truck. Oh, well, we're gonna drive it. And then, yeah, I didn't come here to not drive a fire truck. <laughs> okay. And then, at the end of the video, we'll tell you how much it actually costs and it's brand new and you can see how close you were. Sound good? Sounds good to me. All right, let's go. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go back there by the exhaust and then you're gonna start it because that's what everybody wants to hear in this okay. microphone right here. Okay. Gentlemen, and for once this applies to you, Ben. Start your engines. <laughs> nice. Let's go drive a fire truck. Okay. What I do remember is most of your viewers in the comments say that our banter is funny. Whatever that means. We have, apparently we have banter. It's because they have a child with a sense of humor like we do. <laughs> yeah, we're living our best 12 year old life every day. <laughs> we're, we're literally driving a fire truck. That's exactly I know. what we're doing. <laughs> yeah, we're driving a fire truck. <laughs> There's a fire. <laughs> Hold on, stop. What? I'm at 11% battery. Back it up. Really? Yeah. Put it in reverse. We only had 11% left. All right. Well, that was a failed attempt. We need more battery people. Backup alarm works. Only if it only if the RPMs are high enough. <laughs> the RPMs get lower, it goes pew, 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 pew. Luckily, we got the TJ6 here with some more batteries in it. And cookies and brownies too. Okay, new battery, we're rolling. Round two. Let's try take, this again. Take, what's the, the big clipper board? Take two. Take two? Okay, take two. Here we go. You, it's like whatever light uh, measurement is, it, it's a lot and you have a big ass light on your camera. Hey, well, you know what? Here's the deal. Suddenly it's dark out here. I don't, have, the I don't have a big fancy uh, backpack with special cutout foam inserts for all my camera gear. Because I'm not a YouTube famous person. I just so got that, okay? This, all of this is all that I have. If I take one of these things off, I'll lose it. Put it in your pocket. No, I'll lose it. So it stays with the camera. Back to the important part, the yeah, fire truck. driving the fire truck. Full throttle. Oh, second gear. Hold on, we're going to get third here in a second. Going 17 miles an hour! Woohoo! Oh, there's third. 
almost up to 20, but now we got to turn. This is why it only has 10,000 miles on it. The fire was out before they got there, so they just turned around and went home. They're like, well, forget it. It's yeah. over. Getting close to 20. Gotta get it, gotta get it in third gear. All the gears. Gotta get all the gears. Wait if she kicks into overdrive. Woo wee! How big of a hill do we have to be going down to get overdrive? It'll set you back in your seat, I tell you. <laughs> Totally worth it. That was the cinematic sprint. That's the kind of extra effort that makes my videos just blow up. Yeah, it's what, that, <laughs> yeah. that's how you get in the, uh, yeah. what do they call it? Uh, trending. Trending, yeah. When you're treading, that's how you trending. Trending equals yeah. trending, yes. Yeah. One of these times that I blast the siren, there'll be a police officer and he won't think it's as funny as I do. And then, I don't know, maybe they'll make me get decommissioned in the siren. I will think it's twice as funny. Only if we get it on video. Yes. Yeah, uh, side door popped up. Don't worry about it. It's fine. That's the one you opened. No. You opened those. To we will check the, the tapes. I'm. 98.6% sure I might have, yeah. that you did that. Well, we'll review the evidence. More hose. Yeah. Like, all, all the doors work just fine, nice and smooth. Everything. It's crazy. It... That's... Look, it closed when you made a right turn. But I bet it's not latched. There's you work. know, you could probably climb out the door, walk down the running board, and actually shut it while we're driving. Those are truly functional <laughs> running boards with grab handles. Where's that cop now? <laughs> yeah, where you at, Mr. Peace Officer? Hey, isn't everything legal when the sirens are on? Yeah, I feel like everything is. What do you think, Lucy? It's another truck. Oh, yeah. Loves it. Look at all the room you have back there. So much room for activity. So much room. This is the second best thing you've ever bought. Ramp truck, fire truck. They're they're close. I don't know. The fire truck's got a whole other cool factor. It's a different kind of thing. Yeah. Definitely beers. Don't hit the jeep. I, I trust me. I'm, I know where, right where it is. I might spray it with water, but I won't hit it. Yeah, you can pull off the seats before I drive it home. Yeah, it might be a little warm. All right, well, I like your fire truck. Me too. We'll have to go do a parade. Yes. Spray the kids. Yeah, should we take this in a parade? Let oh me know. Oh my gosh. Can you imagine how excited Riley will be when you get to like let her run the water truck? Drive a fire truck? And like turn the siren on and stuff? Yes. Oh yeah. I'm gonna be her favorite uncle. You have a fire truck, yeah, you win. <laughs> All right, well, that's it for this one. There's like no point in this video. Just when your buddy buys a fire truck, you. You gotta come check out a fire truck and I figured you wanna check it out too. So hopefully you enjoyed that. Let me know. We'll see you next time. Say bye Ben. Hey Ben! Ben! We forgot to tell everybody how much the fire truck cost. Oh yeah. One hundred and thirteen thousand seven hundred and eighty six dollars and fourteen cents. Now, somebody do the conversion to see what that is in today's dollars. Somewhere between 500 and 700 grand would be my guess. A lot. Yeah. All right. Okay, so go before the gate shut. Oh, it's shutting. <laughs>